not not as good an individual today, but did some good things there in team. We just installed some red zone stuff today. So that first day, there's always new stuff. So we're still in an installation period. So some good, some bad. See any separation? <laughs> not talking about separation. See anybody uh, taking control of the uh, starting job? Uh, they're all doing a bunch of good things right now. Going to give some more reps and get some scrimmage time after we get through installation. You guys know there's installation, right? You know it's installation day. We just put in red zone stuff today, so there's a whole lot of evaluation left and plenty of time to, to do that. How are you going to divide the snaps between the quarterbacks on Saturday's scrimmage? Equal reps for everybody? Or? I haven't talked about that. We've got to get through Thursday's practice first. <laughs> okay. Who looked the best running the red zone? Uh, well, first, you know, the first drive, again, it's all about moving the ball and scoring. Who moves the offense there? We scored uh, the first drive there. Connor made a good play on the pull on the zone read for the first down and then, uh, you know, made, made a good throw there to Shamir for the touchdown. So, um, you know, it was well executed first drive, and then we gave all four reps. We went four drives, so four Oklahoma there. So, um, you know, again, it's about executing, putting ball in the end zone. Do they play confident, or are you seeing tentative play out of them? No, no, no. They, they know what they're doing. Occasionally, Lorenzo is, but that's supposed to be because he's a freshman, just learning. Uh, but the guys, the guys, the other guys are, you know, they're getting into some checks, doing some things, showing that they know what they're doing. So, um, it's, but it's about execution too. You know what you're doing. You still got to execute it. Does Connor do a pretty good job with the zone read, and, and is his mobility a, a plus for him? Does he have the mobility to be, be yeah, a plus in that category? Yeah, he's a smooth athlete. You know, he's much smoother than you think. You know, you don't uh, – Coach Connolly even talks about him in the weight room. You know, you don't you don't necessarily think he's moving real fast, but he is, you know. And, and uh, yeah, he's more, he's more than capable of being able to, to run the football. Now, you know, getting 80 yards out of it and all that, like, you know, Lorenzo can, probably not. But uh, – you know, to, to make sure we execute that play and, and when it's when it's given to get what you can, like he did there on, on third down in the red zone period. It's good. Tough kid? Is he pretty tough? Yeah, we'll see. Hadn't seen, he hadn't been hit in three years. You know? I don't know. He got hit in high school. Seemed like a tough kid. Threw it a lot and got hit in high school. So, but uh, they don't, we'll find out. You know, none of these guys have played. So we'll see. But they have stood in there when guys are rushing at them. And that's a big thing. You got to see them practice, stand in there and make those throws. Coach talks about it. I talk about it all the time, you know, being courageous in that pocket. You know, it's not always going to be perfect. You're not going to have five seconds to throw the ball, especially in our league. So you got to stand in there and make throws.